guys, welcome back to another video today. Starting in the gym, um, but yeah, I just want to do the intro quickly. So QPR Rotherham, uh, Rotherham bottom of the league, 12 points behind us, pretty much already down. We have to win. We've bottled every other chance we've had to get out of the bottom three. We're not going to get a better one than this. We have to take it. I, I know what's going on with Chave. Apparently he might be going to prison for assaulting a truck driver or whatever. Um, hopefully he hasn't done it. Free chair. Also very sad news. Uh, unfortunately a 14 year old Ollie passed away a few days ago. Hopefully we can win for him and also for Stan Bowles who has taken ill and apparently won't have much longer left. Really sad news. He's one of the greatest footballers in the club's history. So if we put in a performance that he'll be proud of. Whenever we play a game and have the chance to escape that bottom three, we always fluff it. Like we had Stoke not too long ago, we lost. Uh, we had Millwall, we had Huddersfield at home, went to that game, didn't upload it, but power night, fifth minute equaliser. Like we didn't play well in really any of those games. Um, hopefully that changes today. I'm predicting a 1 0 win. I know Rotherham uh, had their last game as a 4 3 against Ipswich where they lost, but we have a very good defensive record. Our attacking record isn't great, but yeah, 1 0. And um, the 12 points behind us are pretty much down already. So if we lose this, we're finished. Also, Rotherham have the worst away record in the league, yet to win on the road. We've got the worst home record, so there's a time for them to win it, probably is it. But if we let that happen, um, I'll be I'll be really disappointed. I don't care, we have to shit out of the 1-0 today, I, I don't care. Chair starting, uh, Frey starting, first time. We're getting the win. I this game so badly, man. It's seven minutes on the clock and we're already losing. Fuck you, We should be level, man. We had a huge chance there. We're going to the game now. Let's go. Should be level, man. We've had some big chances. Well, we are, we're playing so much better now than we were in the first 10 minutes. We played decent though, man. We've had some big chances. Uh, their goalkeeper's made a couple of really good saves. Okay, they haven't played play too much. Just, uh, Very impressive. Uh, Dunn and Willem on the right. I think yeah. they've been good. Um, um, on the left, Terrell, Chair and Powell sort of falling away a little bit. And the half gone on. We have to take our chances. Let's go. We're going to win, man. We're going to get a point. We're going to get a point. We've had one chance and they scored it. That's the difference. That first 10 minutes was horrendous. Horrible. But since then, we have looked quite good. We lose it. Very unlikely that we stay up, man. I can't lie. Uh, Smith is filled on for the second half. Smith is a really good start because it allows Willard to move into the middle or on the left, and he's much better there. I expect us to win it. Phil uh, coming on as well. Hayden on a yellow card. Makes sense.
result, what a performance. Oh, I'm just so happy, man. A huge, huge result. Stoke losing means we're now out of the bottom three as well. Unfortunately, Mill will want to wear Southampton. I don't know how they pulled that off. And uh, Huddersfield also won. But, mate, I'm confident now. We're going to stay up. We're going to do it. I can't fault the performance at all, man. There was literally nothing negative I can say. Uh, apart from a sloppy uh, 10 minutes at the start, like, we were phenomenal for the rest of the match. And we thoroughly deserved the win. It's unfortunate for Rotherham. I think now they're, they're definitely down. There's pretty much no hope of them. I've been able to salvage a spot in the championship for next year. But thank you for watching, and I'll see you soon for another video.